you are a Marvel legend. I know you don't feel that way, but we feel that way. So why don't you take us back to the very beginning of your creative journey where somehow at a very early age, you knew your prospective future. Can you please share that story with us? Uh, yeah, we have to go way, 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 way back in the way back machine uh, when I was reading comics as a child. And um, I've been making comics proper since I was like five or six years old. And mm -hmm. um, I remember uh, very early I got the bug to draw Spider-Man. Um, he's my favorite character since I can remember. So um, what I did was I assembled a whole bunch of my favorite Spider-Man drawings when I was 10 years old and I folded them up into an envelope and I sent them to Marvel Comics. I had my whole career planned when I was 10 and um, uh, I got a rejection letter and I was very, very disappointed because I have my whole career plan before me. I've, that's the one rejection letter I kept out of the hundreds that I probably got over the years. So I kept my first one when I was 10. That's very and, cool. Uh, so uh, yeah, I've been trying to crack Marvel Comics since I'm 10 years old. And I finally got to do it like a few years after that. It was uh, it was cool. It was very do fun. Do you remember who signed that letter, Joe? I do. His name was Elliot R. Brown. He was uh, uh, one, he did a lot of the technical illustrations for the official handbooks. Do you remember the official handbook of the Marvel Universe? Sure. They used to have it. So they you'd see a picture of the Avengers Quinjet in the uh, you know in the Avengers section mm -hmm. uh, or the Fantastic Four cutaway of the Baxter Building. All those kind of technical mechanical drawings they were done by him. Oh. So I, I I've never met the gentleman Elliot R. Brown, but I've seen his work. As mm -hmm. you know, as a as a collector, I've seen it through the years. It's kind of cool. Right. So now, I know that guy. Now he's part of your history. 